so as I said on my last video, my dad is in town and I just wanted to retell this somewhat funny story just for records and for uh, something I can consider later on down the line. Anyway, uh, the majority of yesterday when I'm spending time with my dad at the hotel, he's visiting from Jersey, seeing me, mainly seeing his grandson, but that's okay because it's great to have such a, such a huge fan of my son uh, in his corner. Anyway, so we're at the hotel at the poolside and most of the time spent with my son is in the jacuzzi and he gets worn out so he sends he ends up spending time with his mother and grandmother uh, by the sunbathing area so that's a great opportunity for me to actually get in to the pool and uh mother is it still recording i'm getting a phone call so okay it's still recording my bad excuse that all right so i'm in the pool and and just the story that i wanted to tell was uh I look like this now and while it is not my peak it's not at the level that I see for myself it, it looks pretty good yeah we look we look decent we look like uh, yeah good anyway uh, I'm moving through the pool and there's these two uh, chicks sitting with their legs kicking in the water and I'm, I'm walking by them and you know it's that slow walk out of a pool where you get taller and taller as you're moving up the ramp of the, uh, you know, how pools change levels. So I'm getting taller and taller. My, my physique is just getting bigger and, and more visible. And I'm walking right by these two girls line of sight and I'm aware of them. I don't deign to imagine that they would be aware of me because most of my life, I didn't really think that girls were paying attention to me. So as I'm walking by, one of them says, hi. And it literally takes me five to 10 seconds for it to register that they're actually speaking to me. So that by the time I look over and smile at them, it's kind of awkward because <laughs> it had been so long since she said hi that uh now it's like oh yeah you you were you were talking to me so anyway i was talking to my uh my roommate about it later that day because he had also joined me at the uh at the hotel and um i told the story and ultimately it just had me arriving at the understanding and acknowledgement that I am inside an eight's body, you know, on that one to ten, uh, that one to ten rating scale of a person's attractiveness. I'm an eight at this point in the game. I, I look and present like an eight, and so I should proceed accordingly. People are going to look at eights, especially when their shirt is off, and it's not something to make a big deal of. It's just something to be aware of. If my shirt is off or if I'm walking through the world and the likelihood is that people are going to be paying attention to me and to just relax with that. That's the new reality that I have created for myself as a result of being obsessed with peaking my physique. So that's pretty much it. As the day wore on, I asked myself what's required of me to become a nine, if it's even possible, given my height, the shit that I was born with, my face, yada, yada, yada. Maybe I can get to nine status if I actually finish this process of becoming wealthy and successful. We shall see. We shall see. Anyway. Uh, just a quick little story. Really got to get into <laughs> actually making relevant content. Uh, these breaks, these breaks, these little deviations from the routine, but baby steps, baby steps, baby steps.
see you in the next one.